I'm going to show you how you can move the positioning of the taskbar from the center to the left hand side manually as well as automating it using group policy. So normally what you would do is just right click the start menu, go to taskbar settings, taskbar behaviors, and then select the alignment to either center or left and that will manually move the taskbar location. But in a corporate environment, you might want to automate this so that everyone has it on the left hand side, the same as Windows 10, just to avoid any confusion. So to do it automatically, if we come over to our domain controller and then open up group policy management, and then under group policy objects, we can either create a new group policy object to do this, or we can uh, amend an existing group policy object that applies to the users. But for this example, I'm just going to create a new object and I'm going to call this win 11 start, win 11 start button. So now we've got our group policy object, we can right click and edit. And then under user configuration, we can come to preferences and then windows settings and then registry. Here we can then right click and do new registry item. And we want to have an action. We want that as update the hive. We want H key current user. And then for the path, we want this path, which is software backslash Microsoft backslash windows backslash current version backslash explorer backslash advanced. I'll put this in the description so you can just copy and paste it. But all you need is that path. And then for the name, we want taskbar AL with a capital T and a capital A. And then for the value type, we want to set that to reg underscore D word. And then for the data value, just put a zero. Now what we want to do is come over to common and then tick item level targeting and then select targeting. And then under new item, select WMI query. And then we want to enter the following query, which is select star from Win32 operating system, where version like 10.0.2 and then a percent. So 10.0.2 is the version for Windows 11. And then we want the product type is one. So that is any workstation. So what this will do is this will only apply this registry key if it is Windows 11 and it is a workstation and not a server or a domain controller. So we can then press OK. So that's applied our item level targeting to this registry key, and then we can apply and then OK. And that's all we have to do in the editor. So if we close this, we've then got our group policy. Now we need to apply it to some users. Now, because the setting that we set was a user configuration, we need to apply this to the users that are going to be um, that we want the supplier to and not the workstations. So all of my users are stored within a user's organizational unit. So I'm just going to drag my new group policy over the user's OU and that will link this policy. So any user that is stored within this user's OU will get this policy and then the taskbar should be on the left hand side. So to test this, if I come over to my PC I can then open a command prompt and then run GP update slash force. Now I'm just running this GP update to, to force it so I don't have to wait. But uh, the next time the user logs off and then logs back on or restarts the machine or their first log on, this will apply it. So if we run this now, it's moved it the alignment to the left and it has also moved the taskbar to the left. So that is how you can automate it. Now, one thing to note is that now every time the user logs in or group policy updates, it will update this registry key and then move it to the left. So if the user does manually set it back, as soon as it updates again, it's gonna push it back to the left. Now, if you want to avoid that, what you could potentially do is in the group policy, you can edit it and then set the comment to apply um, once and do not reapply and then what that will do is the first time it's applied it will move it to the left but then if the user manually changes it it won't get applied anymore and it'll keep it as however they want it so that is how you can use group policy to deploy a registry key to sort the alignment of the taskbar from the center to the left hand side